Six people were injured yesterday morning in a crash involving a Spanish Fork fire truck. Fox 13 News investigative reporter Adam Herbetz takes a closer look at the video. Well, this is the question UHP investigators are asking. Was this car too close to the shoulder or was that fire truck going too fast and cutting it too close? This happened yesterday morning at about 11.45. The fire department was responding to a different crash on I-15 where someone had to be flown out of the area in serious condition. In total, there were seven cars involved in this crash, plus the fire truck, plus a semi-truck. Two women and four children were taken to the hospital, and as scary as all this looks, UHP says all of the injuries were minor. Three firefighters also went to the hospital as a precaution. We obviously, obviously have a, a duty to, to drive with due caution and things of that nature. Um, so, you know, you want to get to the scene uh, because, you know, you're there to help and, and you want to get there and get those people help as fast as you can. Uh, but you also got to make sure you, you arrive at the at the scene safely. UHP told us they are not going to be investigating the Spanish Fork Fire Department's policies. That will be up to the city to decide. When I spoke to the fire chief, he said he would not identify the driver and that he had no comment. Reporting in studio, Adam Herbetz, Fox 13 News, Utah.